It's the Dean Smith Show. We're a good basketball team. Duke's a good basketball team. We are so fired up. We missed Jeff Lebo, but somehow our players uh, made sure we came out with a victory. And we do congratulate Duke. Uh, they handled it, I thought, with class uh, when they did lose. Great game over at Cameron Indoor Stadium. We'll take a look now at North Carolina Duke highlights. We had just missed the, uh, had a call at the other end, and Bricky moves in and gets a shot. What a nice athlete, a great athlete uh, Bricky is. Good pitch ahead, King Rice to Rick Fox, and I think those kind of things help us. It takes the pressure off the board because they have to worry about getting back. Great block by Scott Williams. I hate to use the word great, but it really was. He didn't leave his feet. Good, watch Rick Fox step in here, knocked away, and we get going with our scramble. King tried to protect it, but JR got his uh, offensive rebound as well as a basket. Good move here by Scott Williams. Scott had come in, he didn't start, he came in with the 18-minute mark and really was active. He was emotional but active. Now the clock was going down there, John, and, right. and I hoped we got a better one, but King Rice ended up making a good basket. Steve Bucknell, great pass inside to Kevin Madden. Kevin has such super hands. He thanked him for the, bat, uh, for the pass. Now we're moving it better. Je Jeff Denny gets it into Pete Chilcutt. Pete's been scoring like that. I can't believe the improvement in a year. When he gets the ball inside, I think every one of them's going in. Great pass, Rick Fox to Scott Williams. Scott held off well. We're doing a good job against a very good Duke defense. There's, again, JR being unselfish, passing to Scott Williams. You really show our highlights. We didn't have that many good ones, John. There, Danny Ferry moves in with his body and it's well called. And J.R. Reed goes to the foul line. I don't know whether I like that pass, but fortunately I do like that one. Kevin Madden to Pete Chilcutt. He kept in the air. We were lucky there. I had what I call four lucky baskets where the defense really won, but we did get the ball into J.R. Reed and he can score. I'm trying to set up a back door here. Well, we do out of the four corners, and Hubert Davis gets it. We only went the four corners here. Uh, there we're going out of four and got inside position only because of three guys with uh, three fouls, and you don't like that situation at half. 39-34, Coach, you led it at halftime, and Duke had a big run at the start of the second half. They surely did, and that's the only thing. Now we've come back, but Duke's defense at the beginning of the second half was outstanding. They got a 9-0 run. But I admire our players. They kept their poise. Look at Scott stay after it. Little acting and a uh, good tip in by Scott. He's, he is <laughs> emotional and happy. They're good three-point shot. That kind of gave them the lead at 5, 50 to 45. And now we start to work. They're a good screen by Steve Bucknell, a good pass by King Rice. And now everything goes our way. Excellent defense by Kevin Madden. Coming down, Hubert Davis hits it. I wish he'd had the three point, but I'll settle for two. Hubert liked that, we did too. I don't want to take that away from him. King getting it inside, again, Scott Williams on the board. We really did a good job on the offensive board. And defensively, look at Steve Bucknell making that pass to J.R. Reed after a very good defensive play to read that. We're just playing great basketball here. I like that move, even though it does go in. It, we could have waited for about three passes before we made it. Now this is one of those lucky. I call that, we had four lucky. <laughs> we call them L1, L2, L3, <laughs> and L4. And you have to give Duke's defense credit. Uh, Scott, now this one, uh, I'm not sure, I, I wasn't cheering when he went one bounce, but he can do that, I just don't like the situation what a great play that was that's one of our favorite John you mentioned it Rick Fox we ought to show that a replay if those of you tape it go back and check Rick Fox's defensive play there it's like a, one of the great shortstops Marty Merriam and nobody know whom I'm talking about there one had a great pass Steve Bucknell made the play with a penetration we're in good shape now Scott Williams didn't foul they lean in and King Rice didn't foul, and they fouled King, and Scott got the, we had Scott on five block shots. 
Danny Ferry misses. I think his back was bothering him. King Rice's baseball pass could have left something there. I wish Kevin wouldn't be quite so happy, but I'm glad all of us are happy at this moment. Great win for North Carolina, 91 to 71 at Duke.